Hi, I'm Alex. And I'm Ryland. We're a Cobra Starship, and you're watching BuzzNet. So you guys have an album coming out in like a week? Yeah, a week from today. Exciting. Yeah. Uh, do you know where you're going to be when it comes out? Yeah, actually we're going to be here yeah. in Los Angeles performing at the VMA pre-show. What we've heard of the album so far is like very dance pop. Um, what other like sort of surprises are on the album? Or, like Pop dance. More pop dance? Or you said dance pop. Dance pop. Yeah, oh, they're pop. Yes, oh, different. Huge difference. <laughs> there's some some love songs. It's a lot of love songs, actually. And there's some slower stuff. You guys played the Sunset Strip Music Festival. Yeah. Was Motley Crue the biggest band that you ever imagined yourself playing with? Or is there another band that could top that? You'd be like, I can't believe you're, I'm playing with this band. Um, Man, we played with a lot of bands that are way bigger than us and way more... Like, we're not worthy type of stuff. But, um, yeah, Motley Crue's way up there for sure. It was awesome. Um, Gabe and I watched it from a balcony, from a building kind of far away, through a telescope, actually. <laughs> for real, I'm not kidding. And uh, and it's amazing. He was in the drum set, for, like, flipping up. Uh, Tommy Lee, was his drum set's, like, going upside down. Your girlfriend's foot is on the album cover, correct? Yeah, yeah. How did that come up? How did you ask? Um, it was kind of like run and gun when we were trying to do the photo shoot for for the album cover. Gabe had the idea kind of late, like the whole thing kind of happened quickly and Gabe had this image of a girl or just like a high-heeled shoe stepping into a pair of sunglasses and we didn't even have time to hire like a, a foot model and so a kind of email just went out, hey, can anyone's girlfriend do it and, and um, we all uh, offered our, our, our girlfriend's feet up but mine uh, happened to have a foot that wasn't working that afternoon, so <laughs> she was able to come out and uh, and she had a tattooed foot, so I didn't know if that would make it more interesting yeah. or if they would airbrush it out. And they said they were going to airbrush it out, but they kept it. No, it's good. And she's yeah, she's uh, she made her debut. She got her, her foot in the door. <laughs> <laughs> Did you have to smash a few pairs of sunglasses to get it to look right? Oh man, so like we yeah, we were we were talking about like you know we're like oh we'll just get the really cheap ones. And, and smash like a bunch of those, but they don't have glass lenses. They just have plastic lenses, so they don't smash. So we actually had to buy like a $165 pair of Ray-Bans. And we were trying to get a photo of it just partially broken, and our uh, creative director, I guess, Kai Regan, accidentally shattered it off camera. Oh no. Yeah, so then we kind of reassembled it, and we ended up using, a, I think, a composite photo. How did yeah. you guys get hooked up with the plasticines? Uh, we toured with the Plasticines a long time ago. Um, we did uh, Europe with them. Cool group of girls, really talented. I think we got linked up with them because Butch Walker did their record, and Butch Walker is under our management also, super talented guy. And we needed um, a, a, a vocal part with a group of girls. We tried to do it with our voices, again, really run and gun. We just tried to pitch our voices up, but it just doesn't sound the same. So we, it kind of dawned on us late in the game that we could outsource to France, to them, and, uh, and they did it. It's awesome to work with them. You guys are hopping on Justin Bieber's tour in South America, yeah? Mm -hmm. yeah. How, how do you prepare yourself for that fan base, and what do you expect from them? I don't know what to expect. Um, I'm assuming his fan base is going to be very similar to how it is here in the States, so hopefully um, you know, they'll be open to what we have to offer. Have you guys met him before? Yeah. yeah. We played a show, we played a couple radio shows with him like two years ago, and he came up on stage with us. He's a really cool, talented kid. Talented kid. Great hair. Do you have a prediction for how Lady Gaga will open? She's going to so. stroll up nude, but in somebody else's skin. Oh. <laughs> Do you have an opinion then on who should win video of the year? Tyler the Creator. Yeah. Yeah. I don't even know any of the videos, but if it's which one is it for him for? I can't remember. Yonkers. Yeah. Where he eats the yeah. bug. Yeah. Hands down. 